Welcome back to Owner's Box Trivia. Today, we are doing a football IQ test, except the guys actually don't know what's going on. I decided to mess with them in a bit of, you know, some fun ways in this one, mixing the teams up, and also just what the questions are going to be about. I didn't make the list at the end of the video, but let's just get right into it, and you can see what I mean. All right, Johnny, how much do you feel you know about college football? Not a lot. As the viewers would probably agree, not yes. a lot. I'm a baseball merchant. So this is going to dig deep into your uh, non-existent football knowledge. Based on the current conferences, who was the last team to go undefeated for each conference since 1990? So you're going to get one point for the school and a half point if you can guess that school's exact record. The season does not have to have taken place in the conference they're in now. Okay. So okay, okay, with realignment and everything, it's just the last team in each conference that went undefeated. Ignore. Okay, that's a, that's a, it's good. It's big of you, Babs, to point that out. That's good. I want to say say the ACC most recent would have been Clemson. ACC, Clemson. Clemson? Yes. Clemson? National champions, Clemson. Yep. And what was the record? So 12 regular season games, ACC championship, semifinal, playoff. That would put them at 15-0. and 13-0, and I guess? I'm going to guess 15-0. 15-0. Clemson, 2018, 15-0. and Let's go, dude. So this is the thing. Big 12 could have been Nebraska. In 1999. Big 12, Nebraska, 1999. Incorrect, Johnny. The Big 12, like, a lot of new teams in that conference. I'll go with UCF. Okay, uh, Big 12, UCF. Uh, UCF for the Big 12. Yep, what's the record? For whatever reason, I feel like it's not, it's not, I know it's not 15, and I'm leaning more towards the, like, the 13-0, like, Marshall and Sunbelt. I'm just going to go with that. 13-0. I guess they played the champ their championship game and won that out in 13, and then 14-0 would be my guess here. They didn't play any playoff games, so they'd be 14-0. So close. 13-0. Jesus Christ. Big 10 was Michigan last year. Big 10, Michigan. All right, Big 10. Yes, Michigan last year. The Michigan Wolverines. Yes. Literally and last year. What was year. the record? It was also 15 and 0. 15 and 0? Last season 15 and 0. 15 and 0. You'd be correct. Was Mountain West Nevada? Incorrect, Johnny. Fuck. The only team I could think of would be like the Boise team all those years ago. I'm going to go with Boise State from the Mountain West. The Boise State Fiesta Bowl season, Mountain West last undefeated. What year would that have been? 2008, Boise State? I will guess Boise State. Yes, and can you give me the record for that year? This is either 13 or 14 and 0, and for that reason, I'm going 13 and 0. Uh, 14 and 0? They would have been, oh, do they play a conference? 13 and 0. 14 and 0. Fuck me. SEC was Georgia. Georgia, SEC. Um, SEC's Georgia. Yes. SEC Georgia, 15 and 0. Um, and their record was 15 and 0. Uh, also went 15-0 in 2022. 15-0. You'd be correct. Yeah. Uh, Sunbelt. James Madison. Not in the Sunbelt. Johnny, that was your answer, unfortunately. <laughs> I, think you, I think I have to take that as a guess. That's fair. That's fair. Sunbelt. I don't know the answer to this. App State in the Sunbelt? No. I'll just go Appalachian State. Ryan, that's incorrect. Uh, is it UTSA? No. Okay. Then I give up. Marshall, 1999. Marshall. I'm honestly not even mad about that. All right, guys, we now have teams. How do you feel about your pairing? I'm fine with I, this. I feel fantastic. Listen, it's like two negative. We're gonna, we're gonna have an easier list, so I, I'm fine with it. You sound like hungover as shit, by the way. You, what makes you say that, Sandy? Your voice. The fact that I was up till 1:30 again last <laughs> night. There is like zero percent chance in terms of trivia questions that Johnny and Sandy would ever ever beat me in Avery. In this stage, I'm going to ask you a question. You don't know how many possible right answers there are. So you submit answers carefully because if you go over the total amount of possible correct answers, you're going to get minus one point per okay. team you go over. So we- Oh, we, fucking hell. So we have, to, okay. like, we have to stop on what we think is the right amount because if we guess and we're wrong, I guess. Yeah. Oh it's my God, okay. Organize these into the correct spot. So you're going to tell me what ACC team last beat an SEC team. <laughs> this is all time. Okay. Florida State beat LSU. So you can lock that yes, one off. Yes. North Carolina. Did they? Drake May was there. They had to beat no, an SEC No, they were kind of mid, though. Let's go through each team. So Cal did not. Okay. Cal did not. Clemson. Clemson did. I don't think just, they Just, just put, put the fries back. in the fucking bag, okay? <laughs> uh, Duke. They were Duke nasty have, last year. Though. I don't know if they Duke have. might have. We can honestly. We'll just, come back to We Duke. can just. Yeah, like. Georgia Tech did. No way. No, no chance. I don't think Louisville did. Louisville's dog shit too. I don't think they did. Miami, Florida. 
dog shit. No. I think Miami, Florida did though. Who? They had like an OT game against someone. I forgot. Dude, they lost. Like they sucked last year. No. Okay. Someone stick a pin in this though. I think yeah. I think Miami, Florida did. Okay. I think UN. Let's you go just go in. UNC, brother. There might not even. There might be Pitt, two. Pitt, hundred percent did. Beat an SEC team. Yes. No, they did not. Stick a pin in that one as well, guys. I'm putting Pitt as no. Okay. NC SMU, State. no chance. No. Stanford, potentially. Uh, Johnny, I'll tell you right now that no chance. Syracuse. I don't think so either. Virginia, might have. <laughs> I don't think Virginia <laughs> did. They were also dog shit. Okay, stick a pin in the Virginia one as well, guys. And then you, I don't think VA Tech did either. Okay, Wake Forest 100% did. Let's just write Wake Forest right here. You think? They did, yes. Okay, I'm going to trust you. Betting a quarterback. Okay, so we're through. <laughs> we have all the teams here. Let, let's just look. So what we have, the only four, I think there's not even four, to be honest with you, but uh, we have Florida State, Clemson, UNC, and Wake Forest all beating teams. Johnny, just for the record, wanted to add Pitt to the list and Miami, Florida. What do you think? Yes. You want to add them? Lock this in. No, lock this lock in. Lock what we have in? Lock this in. So you don't want to put your two guesses nope. in? Okay. Well, I do, but I don't want to... Okay, I want to so, alpha you if, if... Okay. So the four answers we have are Florida State, Clemson, UNC, and Wake Forest. Is there one? Johnny was right. Fuck! What did I say? You fucking idiot! What did I say? We got everything else but Miami. You were right. Stick a pin in that. You Go also, that hey, play. you idiot fuck. You also would have went over, so we would have lost a point, right? So don't, you <laughs> no, would have. Yeah, because you wanted Pitt on there, too. Right. You get four points. That's good. That's you fine. didn't go over. That's fine. This is the Big 12 versus the SEC. So the question I'm asking you is, <sighs> which one of these teams on the left uh, beat an SEC team last year? I don't remember any of this. Call, okay, Colorado no. did not beat an yeah. SEC team. Okay. BYU did not. I got to be shocked. They're like the worst team in the Big okay, 12 this year. Okay, so... Who was good? Let's just. Let's Who just... was good last year? Okay, well, Oklahoma State won the Big 12, but they were kind of like a late good team. Yeah. Okay, so Arizona State didn't beat an SEC school. I can all like. Yeah, they were they were pretty shit last year. Yeah, Baylor was shit, right? Yeah, Baylor sucks. Cincinnati wasn't wasn't good. Cincy wasn't good. Arizona Arizona was good. Was good. They were their best team against the spread if you, last year. If you're wondering, U Utah was like seven and five. Well, no, you, who did Utah play to start the year? Florida, and they lost. Did no? Uh, shit. They played Florida at the beginning. They of the won. Year. They beat Florida to start the season. Yeah, I think you're right. Let's just write it down. Okay, like. Okay, West Virginia. What SEC schools were they playing? Because they were backyard brawl last year. No, and that's a ACC school with Pitt, and that was like their big non-conference. So the, they played Pitt. They played Pitt. Was that last year? Or the year yeah. I'm now starting to mix. I've, we've been at this job for so long <laughs> that I'm starting to mix years, and that's the problem. <laughs> Arizona was bad to start the year, were they not? And then they rattled off all their wins in a row? Because that, in that would have been conference in the, games. In the Pac-12, too. I don't think they would have. Okay, now let's start thinking bowl games. Who Houston are, might have gone to a bowl game, but I don't. Like, they stay, they're they going to suck this year, and I, they have a new I'm, coach. Like I'm out on Houston yeah, as waiting. one of the answers. TCU was like 6-6 six and six last year. Yeah. I don't think they were great. Wait, who was Arizona's bowl game? They won. Their bowl game. Okay, I so, know that. Okay. But I don't know. They're pretty good. They were like a three. Noah loss Fafito team. Like, was unreal. I think in the game. Fuck. Did KU win a bowl game? Oh yeah, because Jake Bean was still there too. Fuck. He was good last year and was like always there to bail Daniels out. So they could have won too, but I'm, I'm out on Iowa State being yeah. the answer here. Okay. Oklahoma State must have won their bowl game. I think they did. I'm out on KU winning their bowl game. K State. Did K State? Right now, I think we have four guesses: Utah, Arizona, Oklahoma State, and K State. I mean, I have no clue. <laughs> yeah, I, <know. laughs> I have no fucking clue. I was just thinking, like, how are we going to... Look how long the list is, though. I know, but that could be bad just fucking with us. Do we go three? Who do, we take, like, who do we take out? I think Arizona. Unless they won, like, you're still right. You're thinking because of their bowl game. I think three of these are bowl games, honestly. Wins, yeah? Yeah. Okay. Okay, let's uh, let's do this list then. Whatever. We're going 0 for 4. Utah, Arizona, Oklahoma State, Kansas State. All right, guys. You went over by one because you gave me four, but you got two correct answers. Does that mean we get one point then? Yes. Fuck's sakes. Plot twist. Oh, God. It is now team Avery and Johnny oh, versus God. team Ryan and Sandy. The odds are that these teams weren't what they were the last round, and it's now NFL trivia instead. <laughs> so we won, though. We won. Bang. We won. CFB champs. We won. We yeah. Won. We won. Uh, we won. I got to tell you something, though. The okay. points for you individually have now been added with your new partner. 
So you didn't necessarily just win. Um, well, we, we won that round. We won that. So if we look at the scoring sheet now. <laughs> oh, is there individual? Yeah, because there's individual. Yeah, the beginning. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Get shit on. All right, let's go. No. Okay, let's go. guys. Since everyone loved the most notable NFL player from each state, I decided to bring it right back with a list made by our favorite sports book. The second greatest player for each NFL team. And I have Johnny for this. Okay, wait, what does this mean? The second, the greatest <laughs> cuck for each NFL. The guy, the guy, the guy who, who titled it that, yeah. <laughs> the guy who yeah. sat in the guy who cuck chair for all the years. the title. We played football Guys, cuck trivia. So, it's according to FanDuel came up with the list. <laughs> okay, great. Johnny and Avery will get to go first since they have less points. Um, so how will this will work though, right. guys, is you'll both give answers. Since they're up first, they will give their answer and you will give yours. But yours is the stealing answer, so they'll give oh. what they think is the correct answer, and you'll give uh, okay. your dissenting. We should have let you finish, Babs. My apologies. Uh, All right, I'm ready to fucking fire here. I really am. You get to guess first. I'm Johnny sure there'll Avery. be no bad. Pick your spot. Somewhere. We can go wherever. So we can like start with Dick the Cardinals. Balls so third from there's two possible answers. Who do you think is better of J.J. Watt and Larry Fitzgerald? I think JJ Watt's better. Jinx. Larry Fitzgerald, number two for the Arizona Cardinals. Um, yeah, I would just copy. I always gave it back. Are you guys saying JJ Watt, the like second greatest player for the fucking Cardinals? Like he played like three years there. Yeah, he played oh in Texans God, his whole Avery. career. You guys gave that answer. And it, Larry Fitzgerald's got to be the most. But no, but that's not probably even the most. think about trying to walk over here. That's so you. bad. I just remember him oh, as a that, Cardinal. That, that, that's that's bad. Why I was just confused. I don't. I don't think the that's answer you guys gave was bad, to be honest. But well, who, who, who would be better? That's no. That's a generational. I think fuck Larry Fitz is probably the best Cardinal of all time. Yes. What about like Kurt Warner? Oh my God, dude. Should we just do Kurt Warner? We fucked that. We fucked that. All right, we'll do Kurt Warner. All right, guys, Arizona Cardinals is the team that we'll be clearing. Patrick fuck! Peterson. Fuck! Sorry. Shit! We had that, too. Right, how long was Kurt Warner a Cardinal for? Not, Not that long. long. He but probably was on Joe's like the best years. I think he was there team. for three years. Yeah. Three years, and he didn't play for yeah. the first chunk. He only did a year and a half, I think. Okay. Uh, to football fans, my apologies on J.J. That was, Watt. That was right. just uh, Listen, No, I didn't say that. I didn't suggest that yes, on the rest. I know I did. So you're just going to throw your team under the bus? No, I'm not throwing them under the bus. I'm just the comment section to take it easy on me because Avery's the media darling. All right, our turn. Yeah. Honestly, for the Bengals, I, I think, think we just go Chad Johnson. I think, I think so. I don't think you need a whisper. <laughs> Unless you have like another. Well, I'm just, there's two options. Well, why? Who's the best Packer of all time? Not Aaron Rodgers. That's for fucking sure. Yeah, damn right. Aaron yeah. Rodgers is the best Packer of all time. Brett, Brett Favre. Brett Favre's the second best. We should go Brett Favre for Packers. Uh, Green Bay Packers, second best player of all time is none other than Brett Favre. No okay, so we should, just, we should just say Bart Starr. Like, yeah. Packers, Bart Star. All right, guys, anticipation. Who do you think is going to be more correct? Brett Favre. Yes! Let's okay. fucking I'm go, fucking dude. I'm wow, I thought you were so wrong. I have a better one here. Watch yeah, this. Just, that was free. Watch this. Yeah. Well, for, so now, because it's FanDuel, all of these have been, like, these two are just recent. Okay, that's what I'm saying, True. though. So for, for the New England Patriots, I'm going to say it's Rob Gronkowski. <laughs> That's a good. That's a right. That's answer. a really good answer. If you're a fucking idiot, it's Drew Bledsoe. No, no, it's not. <laughs> I don't even know who. Well, what else are you gonna say? Uh, dude, are you kidding me? Who else would I say? I'd say fucking Randy Moss. No. What about probably... fucking Teddy Bruschi or Rodney Harrison? It's either like Dion Branch. No. Like Chris. Like one of these guys, Chris. Oh, Wes it's, Welker. It's could be, be Wes Welker. It's gotta be it. Or Julian player. Edelman. Julian Edelman better than Gronk. Gronk is insane. Well, we can't, we we can't Gronk. fucking if guess I Gronk. Think Gronk is right. I just. What the fuck else are we supposed to say here? We're Gross. gonna say we're, we're Teddy yeah. Bruschi. You're fine with that? We'll say Teddy Bruschi. All right, let's reveal the answer for the Patriots. I'm gonna shit my pants. Robert Gronkowski. Yeah, yeah. That's the easy, 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 free, easy free. Yeah. Good job, John. Um, okay, second greatest player for each NFL team. I can't. I like in terms of popularity. Like looking at these answers, I think it would be Chad Johnson for the Bengals. Uh, I'm fine with that if you want to go for it. I, it's, a, it's yeah, I'm good I don't know for I don't think sure, he's bad, but yeah. he's not the best for sure. That's he's why the I think they put him second broken. best because. Like he's not the best in stats, I wouldn't say. I would go with that. Okay, let's do uh, Chad Johnson for the Bengals or Chad Ochocinco, whoever's on this list. What about Boomer Sison? That's who I was gonna say yeah. too. Yeah. Boomer Sison for the Bengals. All right, for the Bengals, the correct answer is Chad Johnson. Yes. Yeah, let's go. I'll, yeah. I'll actually, let me guess. Good job, sir. Oh man, should we just do Travis Kelsey for the Chiefs? Yeah, I mean that's clear. I mean, there's no one else really. It's like Mahomes obviously won. Yeah, and Travis Kelsey. Travis right. Kelsey, Chiefs. Do you have any guesses? Um, you got to give it to Mahomes being the best. Like Travis Kelsey, it's okay, one of those two. It's just. It's not Mahomes, dude. If it's no, Mahomes, it's not Mahomes. I'm just saying. What if it's like James Charles? My not sister. James Charles. <laughs> well, we know what's on Sandy's mind. James. Oh my God! I think what you're trying. I think what you're trying to say was Jamal Charles. 
série. I met you all, Charles. So Sandy, wow. Sandy was looking at the lead class. <laughs> I actually, funny enough, saw James Charles TikTok on my feet. Don't ask why it's there, but <laughs> that's why I came out of my mouth. Jamal, <laughs> I think you're thinking of Jamal Charles. Yes. Was, I was thinking of as well. I don't really have a better guess other, other than that. That was so, so dumb. Well, let's, uh, we'll, go, sure. just, just go. we'll go with Jamal Charles. <laughs> all right, the correct answer for here. If for this, is not, cheese, this is not, this is not Kelsey, Kelsey, I will blow a gasket. Let's blow a gasket, Travis yeah. Kelsey. Yeah, Fuck that, that's bullshit. I still think no, that's a good one. Okay, do the one we said. Okay, Houston Texans, wide receiver Andre Johnson. And this Andre Johnson, just so you know, got in a fist fight on the field, that one. With who? Um, fuck. Uh, cool. know. I know. Uh, uh, yeah, Cor yeah, yeah. Cortland? Cortland. Cortland Finnegan. Yeah, there you go. Bang. And yeah. it was in Houston. Yes. Should we say Matt Schwab? <laughs> Matt Schwab. Matt Schwab. Schwab. Matt Schwab. Stop, stop Schwab. Schwab. Charles Schwab. Schwab. Yo, go invest in Charles stop Schwab. Schwab. We should say JJ Watt, because if Andre Johnson would be one, like they're they're one two. Yeah, yeah okay. JJ Watt. JJ Watt. Like, I, wait, I think is that, that final though. Yeah, it's final. Okay. that's final. That's final. That's that's a good that's a good. Way Houston to do Texans it. is Andre Johnson. Yes, yeah. yes, yeah. Okay, okay. Like, that was just all, it was uh, yeah. those two guys. Do your Broncos one. Okay. Uh, no, we also decided that there was another player that could have been in that too. Like for fuck's sake. Okay, no, no, I'll just say it, I'll say it. I think I think it's right. Shannon Sharp Broncos. Okay, so Broncos. Who's John the, Elway is the best Bronco yeah. of all time. That's wait wait. For sure. Don't they have a running back? They have a running back every year. <laughs> oh, <laughs> they actually shit. have usually three or four. No, but they have they have one really good one. Fuck, what's his name? In the early two thousands, late nineties, he was number like thirty. Or is it like I think it's oh, Shannon what about I'm starting to think Shan Sharp. What about Chan Bailey? Oh, that was unfortunately my answer. Chan Bailey is right. I'm. I'll put my nuts on the table for Chan Bailey. Hundred okay. percent, Chan Bailey. It's either Chan Bailey or no or this running back that we can't think. I of. feel good about Chan Bailey because Patrick Peterson was on. Yeah, the list. true. Okay, let's do Chan Bailey. Watch me the best. And if it's not Chan Bailey, it's that other running back, and right. I can't remember. Let's either John Well, or Chan. All Bailey. right, you guys might go a little crazy. It's Von Miller. Totally mm -hmm. didn't. Never even thought of him. Okay, who was the? Oh, you don't know the first, obviously. No, they did not. It's not that first. crazy. No, no, that's Champ Bailey was what I would have guessed, yeah. but I never Whatever. once. That's fine. I never once thought of Von Miller. Neither yeah. did we. I feel good about the Falcons one. Do you? Do you? Like Mike Vick didn't play long enough to be a legendary Falcon. I'm, yeah, I wasn't. That, that's not who I was. I think. I, I think they have some other pretty good players that could be in. But in, look at all these names on these lists, like from 1970. Like there's not. True. Good. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Uh, uh, the second best Falcon of all time is Matt Ryan. To you guys, who the fuck would they have had number one? Deion Sanders, like I told you. You're kidding, right? Deion Sanders played for like a thousand. Mike the, Vick's not the best. Use your brain. <laughs> don't give the, don't give I, it. I'm not going to help I, you I, like, can't use your use, brain. I can't use my brain. Mike Vick. Bro. I mean, oh, uh, Julio. Yeah. I wouldn't even say Julio is better than Vick. <laughs> well, Mike Vick played are, for like. Dude, you are some <laughs> sort of, I'm not going to say the word. Mike Vick didn't play long enough, I don't think. Okay, so we have Julio. Who's better than Matt Ryan, by the way? He clears He's Matt better, Ryan. He's better than Roddy White. But he'd been there forever, and Mike Vick. I think I, I think we say Mike Vick. I think we should say Julio over Mike Vick. Okay, say Julio. Julio Jones. The correct answer is, guys, Matt Ryan. Yes, yeah, Sandy. Good oh. job, dude. Free as it gets. All right, John. Michael the, Turner. The Cowboys the one I think is an obvious one. Michael. The Cowboys one is the farthest. From, they have like the most history of all time. And, like, no, but play. they have two goats. We know the two goats. You can say it. You can out say loud. that. You can say it out loud. Troy Aikman and Zeke, the, or not Zeke. <laughs> wow, John. You're kidding. He Troy knows. Aikman and Zeke Elliott. No, no, he, 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 said, no, no, he said the right one. Troy Aikman and Zeke Elliott, DeMarco Murray. It's Troy Aikman and Emmett Smith. Okay. I don't know there, which one. He said, he said he yeah. said Emmett Smith before. I was, that's where, I was starting to get a look. I do not know who is number two on this one, though. Was Emmett the one who played a million years? Troy or, played or, a million years. No, well, I'm thinking of Emmett and Barry Sanders. Barry Sanders didn't play a lot, and Emmett played forever. I think that's the difference between the two. Yeah, but Emmett was longer than Troy, I think. You decide what you want. I never watched these guys play football. I don't fucking I know. Watched. Johnny was alive for that. Okay. <laughs> yes. Emmett Smith for the Dallas Cowboys. You were going to okay, say Troy Aikman? That's, that's wrong. Yeah. Yeah. Aikman's the right answer. <laughs> Emmett Smith's the best cowboy of all time on like all these lists I've seen. Mm -hmm. okay. Actually, I, I, the answer, I don't know the second guy. I know Emmett Smith's the best cowboy ever. Okay, so let's do Troy Aikman. Let's do Troy Aikman. This is Troy criminal answer. if it's Troy Aikman. It's Troy Aikman. Yeah. I've seen, I, dude, I saw under, this is so convenient I'm seeing this. I've seen, like, I was watching a lot, see a lot of these lists on Twitter. Let's fucking go, sir. That's two for the good guys. And we get to go again. A little double up. Do you have one? Oh, before I start polluting your brain with shit? Uh, I don't have, like, a, a, a solid one. Oh, you know what? You know what? Bills is Josh Allen. 
Because the first is what's his nuts, Kelly. and then it's it's first. I mean, forget about we're forgetting Orenthal, about Orenthal, James. We're forgetting. They're about not put. If they ain't put AB on this list, I'll tell you what they put. Uh, oh, OJ Simpson was the, his like yeah, he insane. Was, no, he was crazy. He's retired for the Bills. Yeah. They only have two names retired. Okay, I just gave you guys an answer. It's Jim Kelly and OJ Simpson. That's only two players. I'm pretty sure retired from the Bills. But you could. That's fu- I I yeah. He rushed for two thousand yards uh, once, with the Bills. Once, right? Yeah, I think once. I think the answer is OJ Simpson. Jim Kelly's the best Bill of all time. First, they went to four Super Bowls with him. Josh Allen fucking Mr. half a playoff win. Yeah. Josh Allen. <laughs> but they everyone fucking like gargles this guy. I, I think I. You know what? They're not putting OJ on this list. Go There's Allen. no yeah, way they're no putting way. fucking. If a, they do, a I'll, convicted I'll, I'll take a loss. He's actually not. He's not convicted. He's not convicted. He's, the gloves. Sorry. Yeah. Excuse me. The gloves. Alleged. Didn't fit. In no, alleged. no, it literally didn't fit. For those We're gonna players. go for the Buffalo Bills, Josh Allen. Okay, counter. OJ Simpson. OJ Simpson. All right, Josh Allen. Bang, that's bang, that's bang, wrong. That's insane. Bang. That's wrong. Yeah. We're, OJ Simpson was one down. of the greatest running backs ever, but and they had Jim Kelly, who's the goat. Bill. Josh, Josh Allen. Allen's crazy. crazy. I mean, he's, the second greatest Bill ever. He's never made it to a does. Super Bowl. Josh Allen, to be fair, like he's never made it to a well, Super I don't know Bowl. How many years OJ did has he made it to an AFC Championship game? Yes, he lost the Chiefs yeah, and the and the and the Bengals. He makes last every year too. I think I'm cool with Josh Allen. I'm not. I'm not cool with Josh. That is fucked up. Oh no, that was before. No, no. Okay, Avery Johnny. It's up to you. Uh, Baltimore Ravens should be Ed Reed. Ray Lewis, number one. Ed Reed, number two. Okay, go with that one. Then I'll, I'll keep the one in my back pocket. Yeah, good. Uh, Ed Reed for the Baltimore Ravens. If it's Lamar Jackson, I actually will kill yeah, I'm done playing. If it's Lamar Jackson, I honestly yeah. think, based on this chalk uh, shit, you don't, but I think it, yeah. who else would you? He's one, what is it, two MVPs? And we're not going to guess Ray Lewis. Like, he's yeah, for number Ray Lewis for sure. Best. Like, yeah. Like, that's okay, well, yeah, the let's, only other answer I had let's is just, Steve, oh, no, Steve Smith was it. Let's do Lamar Jackson. Yeah. Yeah, we'll do Lamar Jackson. Here. I swear to yeah. fucking God. All right, guys, I guess we're quitting. Just kidding, Ed Reed. Okay. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Fuck. That would Thank be that, I mean, if that it was, yeah. If it was Lamar Jackson, Josh Allen's crazy for the Bills, by the way. Thurman Thomas, OJ Simpson. I mean, they they, they were a wagon. Marshawn Lynch is better okay, than Josh is, Allen, for fuck's sake. What about for Minnesota? Kirk Cousins. <laughs> if it, if I see Justin probably Wilson AP, from Minnesota, by the way. The and then Randy Moss. I'm good with that. That's that, That'll that be right. right. Because AP's the best yeah. fighter by a fire. Fe- no. I feel like he better, has to be. Because he Randy never... No, he, well, he did leave, the but, but no, yeah. AP was there forever. That's Minnesota, Randy Moss. I'm good with Who was that huge DN they had, too? Like purple people eaters era. Oh, what about Jared Allen? I think Justin Jefferson's more talented, but uh, he's uh, been in there for. If it's Justin Jefferson, he's played fucking three years. I think we have. I think we have to go the ladder of what they said. AP is. AP. He's just the best Viking of all time, though. We're not going to win. Those two players are better than Jared Allen. So, uh, Jared Allen only did it for the Vikings, though. Okay, we'll do Adrian Peterson. Even though he's number one, I just think. All right, the correct answer for Minnesota. Yes, Randy Moss. Okay, I, I'll do. I want to do mine. Indianapolis Colts, Reggie Wayne. No, Marvin, Marvin Harrison. Harrison. Thank you, Johnny. Yeah, Marvin Harrison. That is so dumb. That is Marvin dumbest Harrison. Dumbest it might answer. be Reggie Wayne. No, Marvin that was thing. That was just so <laughs> sad. <laughs> Come on, man. That is crazy. I wish. I wish. That is I crazy work on it. <laughs> no, I, t- I said that to you. I said we have three guesses. That was, that was, I'm not. I'm not mad at you for that. Don't worry. I thought Reggie, Reggie Wayne, Wayne, Marvin Panthers, Harrison, Panthers, and Andrew Luck Steve were the three. Uh, Panthers, Steve Smith. Okay, I think we have two better guesses than yeah. Steve Smith. With CMC. McCaffrey and Keekley, I think are better guesses. Keekley would be 1-1, one, one, I think. No, Cam's 1-1. Oh, one, one. Or sorry, Cam's 1-1. One, one. Keekley, I think uh, Keekley. Okay, Luke Keekley. It is Luke. Fuck, wow. Fuck. Um, Good guess, guys. I don't even know who number one for the Browns would be. Jim uh, Brown. That's who I thought that would, would be. Jim Brown's past okay, the one-one. Okay, well, then how about... Uh, the tackle that played there? Andrew, no. Joe Thomas? Yeah. I, it has to be Joe Thomas. I mean, he played 15 years for them and... It was the best. Yeah. yeah. Joe Thomas for the Browns. I don't even know who else it would be other than what Joe Thomas. Should we say Nick Chubb? I mean, Nick, Ch- right. Nick Chubb's not even the best guess on the current team. Let's yeah. just say, say fucking Nick Chubb. Uh, Nick Chubb. Joe Thomas, for sure. Nick, right. Nick Chubb. We know they're right here, though. Yeah, the, the intern didn't fuck that one up. Yeah, yeah. Job. Um. All right. Okay. Jets. Darrell Revis. I don't even know who to come up with here. I really don't. I don't know if you, you can just drop. I. I really. Brett Favre. Maybe. We can. Do we want to just go with Mark? San- I don't know. Yeah. Mark but, Sanchez. Jets. All right. New York Jets. Darrell Revis. Let's go. That was nice. Yeah. Okay, do your answer right now. Okay. We will do the New York Football Giants and Lawrence Taylor. Oh, because they're going Eli Manning. Yeah. I think we just go Eli Manning. There is Phil two Sims. options. Phil Sims, no. maybe, but no, I, I think we just go Eli Manning. Yeah. Eli, Eli Manning. Manning. 
The correct He's answer is right Eli Manning. That's some disrespect to Eli Manning, but we'll Lawrence right. Taylor is noted like he every- won two Super Bowls for them. Dude. Yeah, what the LT, fuck is? But L- Lawrence Bowl Taylor was like the is like the best defensive player yeah. of his generation. Hundred hundred percent. That's I just thought they'd give it to yeah. Eli. Yeah. Okay, so I thought they would have. Now we're up again. Okay, what do we, the, like for, this, for the Saints, one. Like like Drew Brees one, and then Jimmy Graham because he dominated. I like the Jimmy Graham. Yeah, uh, for the Saints, uh, Jimmy Graham. Jimmy Graham sounds wrong to me. Uh, we'll just go Alvin Alvin Kamara. Is it Kamara? Right, guys, Johari Evans. I don't even know who that it's is. It's probably an offensive line. I was just thinking after, I was like, maybe it's Cameron Jordan or Cam fucking, Jordan. maybe they gave it to fucking okay. Reggie Johari Bush. Uh, we can, we can okay, say, say that one you said it. All right, so we are we are heading to the great state of, of Tennessee, and we are between two names. Is Derrick Henry better than Chris Johnson? Yes. And we think Warren Moon's won. Yes, Warren Moon's won. Well, what do we want to say about Steve McNair? Oh, this, is, this is a tough one. Yeah, I, forgot I don't Steve know if I'd pick this one. Steve McNair. Guaranteed. Okay. Yeah. Steve. I, I think Derek Chris Henry Johnson will be number one on this list. I swear. I th- God, that's how recency bias. Dude, like, why is everyone disrespecting Chris Johnson? That's what I said. CJ2K. Like, there's also Eddie George. I mean, the same fucking answer, man. We, Put the fries we, in the let's bag. Let's do Chris bro. Johnson. Yeah, Chris, Chris Johnson. Johnson. Correct answer is Derek Henry. Wow. I said it. Well, you thought he was. It was one. Of, it was one of multi. All right. What I, is, uh, now I want to know who some Warren of these. Moon's probably the best. Then that's who. That's who we slotted in as the yeah. best. I, I, I think the Niners, the best of all time, Jerry Rice, obviously. Okay. Joe Montana's not the best quarterback of all time. It's Joe Montana's yeah. the answer. So the 49 okay. You're good at that. Yeah, sure. San Francisco 49ers, second best player is Joe Montana. Can we just say Jerry Rice? Because there could be a bias for quarterback. Sure. Yeah. yeah. Jerry Rice. What? <laughs> <laughs> What the fuck? Steve Young is not better than Joe Montana. In maybe hey, maybe they have Joe Montana, Steve Young, and Jerry Rice. It is hard to speak in absolutes because Without I've knowing. never seen that and I don't know the stats. That's wow. the worst answer on the list. I'm, I'm really sorry. Sure Steve Young. The Lions, it's either Barry Sanders or Calvin Johnson. That's it. You don't think Matt Stafford's in there? Would you put Matt Stafford ahead of either of those two? No. No. So that's what I'm saying. I think, and I think wow. Calvin Johnson's probably the best. Yeah, I think we say he I, played longer. I think we say Barry Sanders. Or sorry, I don't know if he played. Years longer. Let's say Barry Sanders. Barry Sanders, Lions. I think it's. I think it, I honestly think think it could be Calvin Johnson. I like. Well, they gave Barry Sanders. I like yeah, Barry Sanders. I think it could be Calvin Johnson because I think there's a chance maybe Barry, Barry just gets it because I'm of, because of I'm good with length. that. I'm good with Let's go with Calvin Johnson. Calvin Johnson. Let's go. Fucking right, sir. I I was so confident in Barry Sanders being that answer. I've been saying to him for like the last 20 minutes. So I'm happy you guys did that for us. The Was- the Commanders. I honestly have no, no clue. Who's the best Commander of all time? That quarterback that you know, no. Ted, Ted Williams. Ted Williams. No, that's Is a that? player. Uh, Doug Williams. Doug Williams. Okay, we got to come up with a guess here. Incredible name. Best Ram of all times, Eric Dickerson. Yeah, someone be the great. Oh, actually, wait. You think it's Eric Dickerson? Really He's good. the best. Yeah. Because then the second best has yeah, got to be Tory Holt or Marshall Falk. But I think Tory Holt's better than Marshall Falk. You say whatever one. Tory Holt and Marshall Falk. I think it's Marshall Falk. Whatever. Let's just do it. Well, uh, the uh, the Rams. Tory Holt. Just say Aaron I thought Donald. You were... Yeah. Aaron Donald. Fuck. The correct answer it's is. Aaron Donald. Corner. <laughs> Are you kidding me? That grocery fucking bag stuffing idiot. Uh, okay. Okay. Fine. Well, we weren't even there. Yeah. Clinton Portis, number yeah. two for I, the for Washington sure. Commanders. Yeah, I think that's. I think Doug you guys Williams answered. Clinton Portis is better than Doug Williams. No. Clinton Portis won a lot of. Super okay, Bowl. we can guess Doug Williams, but I think that's so wrong. Didn't he win like three Super Bowls with this team? Wait, 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 wait. What about Joe Theismann or whatever? Wasn't he really good? Yeah, but like, fuck, I don't know if he's the answer. Joe Theismann. Okay. We want to go with Doug I, Williams. I, think Joe Theismann. Actually, I don't want to go with Doug Williams. I think Joe Theismann. Okay, Doug Joe Theismann is our second. Our guest. All right, for the Washington Commanders. Sammy oh yeah, right. How could Slam and Sammy. The Seattle Seahawks one could be who's the best Seahawks? Sean Alexander. The second best could be Steve Largent. That's what I'm saying. You think Sean Lar- Alexander's number one? No. You know, well, there's Marshawn. There's also Marshawn Lynch. There's fucking Russell Wilson. Richard Sherman. Richard Sherman. Okay, Russell Wilson, uh, second best Seahawk of all time. I mean, I Let's do that. Richard Sherman. I think we gotta do Sherman. Richard Sherman. Sherman. The Shermanator. All right, Russell Wilson. Go. Um, Thank you, intern. Right. Mathematically eliminated from playoff contention. Yes. <laughs> All right, let's just fly through this then. Chargers is hard. Do we want us to say LT? You think it goes for Phil Rivers LT? Yeah. What about Sean Merriman? <laughs> just say the What about Antonio Cromartie? So it's, yeah, LT, Antonio Gates. I think, I honestly think it's Antonio Gates. You do whatever you want. It doesn't. It, okay, no Nadine long. Tomlinson, Chargers. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think, I don't, man, LT's got to be the best charger of all time. I think What's so the fuck too. did Phil Rivers do? I, it's either what did LT do? Yeah, I mean, he, what do you mean? He's like second all time in all rushing yards. 
I think I think first in touchdowns. Phil Rivers went to. Uh, I, think Phil Rivers. I think it's Antonio Phil Gates. Rivers or Antonio Gates. I think LT is clear. You ball. You just put your nuts. I think. I think Phil Rivers. Yeah. Phil Rivers. He's legend. dead. That's true. Also, so. Fuck. Because it's our turn, right? It's your turn. Yeah. Just uh, do it. Uh, this is the, such a shit guess. The second best Steeler of all time is Antonio Brown. So, like, if there's Steelers Wait. fans in this, they're do gonna it. they're gonna big fan. Head head on a stick. I think he'd be number one. Terry Bradshaw won a shit ton with them, and then Big Ben. Okay, let's do Ben Roethlisberger. Ben Roethlisberger. I think that, I think that's more right. It is more right. Yeah, good guess, dude. Antonio Brown's the best dealer of all time. I mean, he's probably top Most ten TV for sure. He's probably top ten. Okay, it's us. Bucks. Do we want to do Warren Sapp, or is he their number one? I think one? Warren Sapp is their one. Okay, do we want to do Tom, Tom Brady? Tom Brady would probably be their two. <laughs> Legit. It sounds fucked, but he won them their second Super Bowl ever. I think Tom Brady for the Bucks. Bro. Okay, and I think no. Wait, 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 wait. I'm not putting it out. I'm talking. Yeah, yeah. I think the answer is Mike Evans. Played ten straight would, years honestly, of Dallas. So honestly, Brady? I think yeah, Tom Brady. No, I yes, think it's, he was on the team. He did a thousand. Shut up! You don't even know around. what I'm gonna fucking say. I think it's. I think it could be Rondé Barber. He played. He was there Tiki. forever. Tiki was also good. <laughs> <laughs> but I if you think it's Mike Evans, go with Mike Evans. Jeff Antonio Garcia. Brown. That was a good guess last time. Mike but, Evans is crazy though. I, I wouldn't say. That's a lot. Go with Mike Evans. All right. The second best buck of all time is Mike Evans. It is one sap. Oh, you guys, guess, you guys guess that, right? No, no, we got Tom, Tom Brady. Brady. Who, wait, who would be one then? Tom Brady. I don't know. The last thing. There is no way. I mean, yeah, we, we could just be missing okay, something. Um, who else was good on the Dolphins other than Dan Marino? Like, legit anyone. Okay. Finkel. Like, like, should, can I just guess one for <laughs> yeah, the Dolphins? Just Fucking Jason Taylor. Oh, pretty good one. Oh, that's a good guess. I didn't even think of him. Ricky Williams. <laughs> yeah? <laughs> yeah. He well, was I mean, Ricky yeah. Williams, Dolphins. Jason Taylor. Yeah! Oh, let's go. Hey. We are getting hey. shit pumped. Wasn't Reggie Green an Eagle? I know he's like a Packers legend too. What was Reggie he? Reggie Green? Do like you, why do you, why do you this have like- Again, this sounds crazy. Do you think Don McNabb? Why don't we just say Jason Kelsey? Who would be number one? I honestly could, you can make the argument Jason Kelsey's one. He's the greatest center ever, right? Yeah. Oh, I'm thinking of yes. uh, Joe Green. Big mean, mean Joe, Joe Green. Mean Joe Green. Okay, for Eagles, let's just say Jason Kelsey then. Sure. Jason Kelsey yeah. Eagles. Okay, so the best Eagle of all time has got to be Reggie White. I think that's who you said. Did you say Reggie Green? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. That's who I said. Yeah. Reggie White was the hey, name. Hey, Johnny. Congratulations. Jason yeah, Kelsey. Let's go. Yeah, it's fine. It wasn't our guess. Got some names mixed up there. Okay. That's okay. Um, it happens. The Bears? Yeah. Who do you think the Bears is? I what? think the best of all time is Walter Payton yeah. for the Bears. And, and, then, from the and I think the second best. What about Charles Tillman? I think we go mm -hmm. Charles Tillman. No, the refrigerator Perry. The, the, Who the, the fuck is that? The, the best defensive player. player. Yeah, he's scored a touchdown. He scored a touchdown. Yeah. Uh, Put him in that fullback. Refrigerator Perry. Why don't we just first name? Why don't we just say Dick Buckus? Dick Buckus. Yeah, right. Brian Urlacher. Oh, oh, for oh. fuck's sake! Oh, oh, for yeah. fuck's yeah. yeah. sake! That was really dumb of us. Oh my okay, god. Up. Go. Blake Bortles. <laughs> <laughs> You think Maurice Jones drew? He's got to be yeah, the best. Be. Uh, let's do David Garrard then. David Garrard. Jaguars. Okay, wait, who was the? Remember we did that trivia and the Jags all-time passing leader was who? What was his name? Oh, fuck. Oh, uh, Mark Brunel or whatever. Mark, Mark Brunel. Mark, Mark Brunel. Brunel. It's not, um, but that's been brought up in three trivias now. It's Jimmy Smith. No, I don't know. No, I don't know. Okay, okay, you guys and go. The, no, it's, it's oh, us. It's us. Oh. Raiders. Uh, Ken Stabler, uh, what's that other guy's name? Uh, oh, what's his name? No, no, no. Uh, the USC running back, uh, Allen, Darren uh, McFadden? Mar it's not Darren no, McFadden. No, okay. USC. Oh, uh, Marcus Allen. Oh, Marcus, Marcus Allen's Allen. the best, do you think? I think so. So Ken Stabler, or there's another quarterback, I can't remember the name. Uh, but Mark Sound's probably the best, so should we just go with Ken Stabler? Ken sure, Stabler. Sure. Uh, why don't we just do Jerry, Jerry Rice? Jerry Rice. Jim Otto. Yeah. Who the fuck are you, Jim Otto? <laughs> Boom! That's a victory! All right. Ten. How do you feel, all Ryan Sandy? Great. Okay. Another notch on the old tool belt. Beat us by nine sorry. and a half, folks. Close. Sandy's close. first win of the year. <laughs> yeah, the calendar. And if you get half a win, Johnny also get half a win for contributing. <laughs> Well, it looks like Ryan carried Sandy to another win. Doesn't seem like Sandy always knows ball, but he kind of did today. If you enjoyed today's video, make sure to subscribe. If you've got feedback about the video, let us know in the comments.